So I got all of my Amazon orders. Now I'm gonna unpack them. It's mostly a surprise. So double sided glue runner. I'm gonna use this for my watercolor painting. Hey. Okay. Let's see what this is. This is the oil painting and there's uh, 12 colors. I think it's, uh, oh, I've never really done oil painting before. So this uh, is a good start set. If I ever do my first oil painting, I'll share it. <laughs> I'll record it and I'll share it. I was always intimidated by the thought of doing oil painting, but uh, I decided to try it because the other day I tried a uh, gouache painting and uh, uh, it wasn't too bad. And then I was thinking, hmm, let me do a little bit of uh, oil painting then. This was the little, little gouache painting I did. Now I'm ready to try a little bit of the oil paintings. Something I've wanted for a long time is the Hobain gouache, and it's 24 colors. Before I had the Arteza gouache and uh, the painting I just showed. So you guys was done by the Arteza gouache. It is this one, or Arteza or Arteza, whatever it is. Anyway, never really good with the pronunciation. So it's a 60 color, 60 color one. And I tried it, I liked it. And I think um, I want to practice with, uh, because a lot, I saw a lot of gouache uh, artists that I, um, I follow, they use the uh, Hobain ones, so I got this one. Well, I appreciate all the effort we did wrapping this up. Oh my gosh, it's really layered up. <laughs>
is this? No. What? This is as pretty. Well, I ordered this before I want to make some, put some small things and some accessory in it. Yep. Sorry about the noise. It's so pretty. I love this one. I think uh, I rarely get uh, damaged uh, stuff from Amazon. We pack it really carefully, actually. I should, probably I shouldn't have said that. I don't want to jinx myself. Ooh, this one. I wanted to put my paint brushes in it. Wow, look at that. Isn't that pretty? Is very professional. Oh, yeah, this is another one. Oh, my gosh. I got all the phones on me. Oh, look. Nice, beautiful. Last one, but definitely not the smallest one. It's the biggest one. Let's see. Okay. Come on, big guy. I know what this is. I know exactly what this is. Do you guys know what this is? <laughs> yeah, it's another one of the glass set. watercolor set i've heard a lot of good things about this watercolor sets and i've seen a lot of artists using this brand so yeah it's a 24 color set you know i'm not really crazy about getting a lot of colors nowadays anymore because uh, I think more a lot of colors can be overwhelming. Actually, 24, I think uh, it's uh, for watercolor at least, is plenty. It's uh, enough. So these are the 24 colors. I will try them out. 
and uh, I'll, I'll let you guys uh, know how it is like. Brand is QOR colors. Okay, this one. Oh, this is a tape, masking tape, artist tape. This is a good size and easy to peel. And uh, this is a porcelain paint palette. I really like the design of this palette, which is why I got two of them. It's really, really cool. Now I can put colors in different wells, like small wells like this, and mix it in the middle. And guess what? If uh, I can also flip it, and then mix it like in in this evenly distributed uh, spaces. So it's really a cool design. I really love it. And I go one for watercolor and one for um, gouache paint. brand I think is pretty well known one is uh, Meden. Okay, that's our last item. This is a light pad. Well, I've been thinking about like uh, whether I should get a light pad for tracing or not because sometimes I do want to transfer some uh, line work into a watercolor uh, paper and then that will be easier for me to uh, I I try to do like a freehand and uh, I like doing the freehand. I think it's cool, but Sometimes when you want to save time, and uh, you can just use a tra use a this light pad, and to trace that, it saves you some time. But of course, it's always uh, better to do it freehand. Whoops. Okay, so I mean it's pretty bright. I'm gonna try to put this on there and uh this is a watercolor paper. It's a Strathmore watercolor paper. And let's see. Oh, wow. You can see it pretty clearly. So, this is good. This is really good. I like it. Now you can change it to warm light to protect your eyes. Here. Oh, it's a really cool design. Very stable. These are all my Black Friday purchases, at least the uh, art related purchases. And I'm really looking forward to try them out.